Oh, sure. Mary Lynn Owen. M-A-R-Y space L-Y-N-N. My name is Dorothy Bell Polk, and I am playing several characters. My name is Renita James, and I'm playing lots of different characters. My name is Brooke Owens, and I'm part of the ensemble for Revolt. I will be exploring quite a few characters in the show. Christopher Hampton, <laughs> ensemble member, male. <laughs> yeah, human. My name is Patrick Wade. I'm playing various characters in the seven stage productions of Revolt. She said Revolt again. I was so invigorated by the fury of it, the outspokenness of it, the f funniness, the humor, the edge, and the fearlessness of it. This show is important, especially given the climate that we're in just across this nation relevant it's timely it it it's clever um we jump straight in to the work and that's really exciting to me um to have the focus be on what we can create it's very rare and precious to get to do theater that directly speaks to the world as it's happening right now I think we as artists have a really unique role in calling things out and speaking up for injustices. I think artists have a responsibility to ask the questions. We don't have to answer them, but we do have to ask them. Our actual duty in our work is to get up and speak and perform in front of others. That platform is really sacred and I think that it's the safe space to have an opinion and state a cause or a purpose. Walking in someone else's shoes, even though they, sometimes they don't fit, but being um, um, humble enough and also brave enough to share their stories, it's, it's a humanizing thing. Yeah, I think, I think you would be hard pressed to find a woman who is not experienced in their own way uh, being a part of the Me Too movement. Me Too didn't come out of nowhere. It's not... A, a cause of the moment. It's been a part of the landscape for a long, long time. Any time an actor can be involved in a project that really feels like it's on, on the front lines of 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 what's relevant um, in our society, that's always very exciting. It's a chance to make theater that's really effective and present and necessary. You know, vulnerability is a really important thing as an actor, and being put into a, uh, a situation where we can't, you know, duck behind a curtain, or, you know, we can't uh, take a break or have a moment off stage where we can, you know, disconnect from the action that's happening on stage. Now, more than ever, it's just so important that we find our voices in the midst of all of this. Um, and know that you know we have the strength and the power to change things. 